All right, we're going to unbox the Harrier Close Air Support Flight, and I'm joined by Steven. Hello. And this is actually his models, and well, he thought these were his models. He's not going to go home with them. <coughs> I beg to differ. <laughs> I, I don't know what happened to your Harrier. <laughs> so there's the front, and I have a feeling this picture's on the other side. Yep. And then there's the... I've never seen the underside. This is the first one I've seen a picture of the underside. Interesting. All the other pictures have been like the side or top, so that's what the underside's going to look like. So you get two Harriers and a Unicard. I think you'd get flight stands, wouldn't you? I would expect. Don't you get flight stands with this one? Unless it's all grounded. No, I shouldn't. No. They. Okay, now I'm a little worried because you think there'd be... Oh, this is interesting. Don't see too many of these with this type of stuff. So we got... I have a feeling maybe there's one because there's another one in here. Oh, I see a flight stand right there. They must have okay. not labeled it. Okay, so I'm trying to pull this out. There we go. And there's the cards. So I think each one of these probably holds a, a Harrier. You know... Okay, I'm going to... I gotta open this up because I want to see what this thing looks like. And I hate these boxes because I am the worst person. They are the hardest things to open. <clears throat> wow. That is. I think all you gotta do is put the the tails on or something. There's not... That's going to be the hardest piece to put together. <laughs> I don't think there's much else to put on it. Except for the... I don't know what you call that. It's not the rudder, because that's the rudder, but the back wing or something? I don't know. Wow, that's... They even got the rockets already on it, or whatever that is. Wow. I'm so used to, like, my frog foot, feet, whatever, where you have to put the nose cone on, you have to put the rockets on it. This is... I kind of like this. Where it's just, it's almost ready to go. It's pretty cool. And you got your stand. So you got your really tall one, of course. I got my stand that wasn't labeled on the box. Right. Now, the only thing I'm wondering is where's your tail? It may be in this box. I don't know. I don't see. Because, yeah, see, it does have. <laughs> that is true. All right, so I'm going to try to open this one. Maybe it's in here. Because I'm feeling this and there's nothing in that as far as for the model. Okay. So this is the same model. I still don't see the... Ah! Whew. And you know what? It does come with magnets too. Oh, you do have rocket pods to put on. Never mind. So looking here, oh, there's, okay, so here's what you're putting on. You've got a nose cone to put on. One looks like two rockets and then your tail. That's rough. Yeah, especially after the frog foot, so I'll tell you. So I'm gonna put that over there. And you get a free carrying case. So I'm gonna pop this open and see what we got here. Oh, these are metal. I thought they'd be resin or something. That, I think they're, well, maybe they are resin. It's just a silver. Here, see what you think. Maybe it is just a resin. It's just kind of a silver. I think it is resin. Well. Really? It feels like metal. It, it looks like metal, but it's really light. You know, I have no idea. Maybe they did do metal. They thought the light was enough to put in. Yeah. Modeling, so. Wow, you do get a lot of rockets. You get three, six, you get four, so you, yeah, two for each wing, I guess, which they showed in the picture. There's your two nose cones. And your, uh, I'm going to call it your tail. And your magnets. So you get four magnets. And then your decal. 
So yeah, I think these this symbol here is like the Air Force because the yeah. the tanks and all that had the flag. This one I don't know. What does it say there? A M. Is that Australia? You know, oh, maybe not. A M A T A O. Oh, I guess it's some ident number identification or something. Maybe those look like they might be wing design decals because of their shape. What is that? Is it going to focus in on it? Huh, they get. I don't know enough about the British to know what that means. And these down here, I don't know either. I got numbers on them. Four, four, four. Those are lightning bolts. Yeah. Huh. I don't know. And then you got your card. Is it a card? Did it say one card? Yeah, it says one unit card, and that's what we've got. Harrier. Yeah. Close air support flight. Gosh, that eight. Bam. Has to get in close, though. But this jump jet, this strike aircraft thing, jump jets give it a three plus to come in. That is just awesome. Mm, that is pretty nice. That is three plus for this aircraft. And this model is nice. So what I want to do is I'm going to bring in my frog foot and kind of give a size comparison. So, well, if you add the nose cone to it, it's going to come out about the same size because you still got to put the nose cone on it. So it's pretty close to the same length. <laughs> Wingspan's a bit different. <laughs> a lot different. <laughs> but you know what? If I was playing a game, I, I'd, this, I'm jealous. I really like this jet. And I think also this sitting on the table, painted up, playing in the game, it kind of get people interested. Yeah, in the game. I agree. Man, that is a nice, nice model. So that's everything, minus the frog foot. That is everything you're going to get in the Harrier Close Air Support Flight.